It's Patrick from Half Wheel, and this is the Zycar Meridian, one of the company's newest lighters. Just started shipping out to retailers in early June of 2020, and it is a triple flame lighter, but it is not a triple flame torch. Rather, it is a triple soft flame. As you can see right there by that plate, I'm going to pull this in a little bit closer so you can see those two little holes right there. There's a third one right there. Those are the ends of three separate fuel lines that come up from the tank, and each of them is their own soft flame, and together they form one big oversized soft flame. Really unique deal that uh, you don't see too much on the market. There are some other lighters that have a little bit bigger flame, but definitely nothing that bills itself as a triple flame. So to give you a little bit of rundown on the Meridian, it's available in six colors. This is the blue and gunmetal option. There's also black and gunmetal, red and gunmetal, and for those of you who really like gunmetal, yes, there is gunmetal and gunmetal. There's also black with gold and black with rose gold. Now, each of those six options is priced at $149.99 and comes with Zycar's limited lifetime warranty. Now, as far as the features, pretty, I don't call it bare bones, but it's a pretty much no-frills lighter. Again, nice big uh, roll bar cylinder here that uh, serves as the ignition mechanism, which we'll get to in just a minute. On the back side, red tinted fuel window, so you can see how much butane you have left in the lighter. And then on the underside, is a flame adjustment wheel and your typical fuel valve right there. Takes regular butane, Zycar HP works great. That's what I've been using in it so far. Now, as far as the flame adjustment wheel, nice big ridges right there. It's a little tight, at least this particular one. And so sometimes you might wanna use the screwdriver notch right there. Uh, but once you do set it, it hardly ever budges. So that's really nice and predictable. Uh, it has a lot of room to customize the exact height that you want for your flame. Maybe even a bit too much, if you ask me, at the high end, because if you do crank this all the way up and open, and especially if you use the HP fuel, you will get a flame that is a couple inches tall and way too unwieldy to light a cigar with. But beyond that, there's no punch cutter, there's no Bluetooth, there's no Alexa or Siri or anything like that. It's pretty much a big triple flame soft torch. There's soft flame, not, not really a soft torch. Now, being that it is a soft flame, there is a flint involved, and that is a user-replaceable part. And I'll show you how to do this because it took me a second to figure this out because I don't really use a lot of soft flames. You just slide that little bar back right there. And if you kind of shake it out, you will find that, and that's a little piece of flint. And Zycar is going to start selling replacement flints very soon. I am told they are close to arriving in the country. A little bit of a delay with uh, shipping due to COVID and coronavirus and all that fun stuff. They're going to be $4.99 for a 10-pack of replacement flints. Now, all you do is you drop it in that little chamber right there push this button and with any luck you will have a nice working lighter with a brand new flint in it now the big selling point about this is obviously the flame so let's turn the lights down and give you a look at that flame because it really is pretty interesting so to get the zycar meridian lit the first thing you want to do is flip open the lid and that'll start the butane flowing then give that cylindrical roll bar a nice push with your thumb and you will have a nice big single soft flame lighter ready to light your favorite cigar with now this is about where I generally set it, maybe a little bit bigger. I've been kind of playing around with it to figure out the best setting. And like I say, if you really open this up, you are going to end up with a pretty sizable flame that isn't going to be of much use to light your favorite cigar with. But as you can see, there's three separate flames that come together to form one big flame. You can kind of see those three blue lines right there. That's where the individual flames are coming from. And then they're uni uniting up to form that one big uh, flame right there. So again, like if you do like a soft flame, but you want something with a little more power because you smoke bigger cigars or you use a little bit heavier tobacco, certainly an option for you. So that's what the Zycar Meridian looks like as far as its flame. And generally, nice solid flame. There's a little bit of flicker at the top, and that's something that I've seen kind of throughout the usage, but certainly makes for a pretty solid flame. And again, just a little bit of breeze in the room where I'm at, so that's probably what's causing that flicker. So... Let's turn the lights back up. Now, as far as the day-to-day -day usage, again, this is a soft flame. It's a big soft flame lighter, but it's still a soft flame. So if you've used a soft flame and you're aware of their limitations, meaning that if you smoke outside on windy days or downwind of a fan, as I happen to do a lot of the time because I live in Phoenix and it's really hot and my swamp cooler is on for probably half the year, it does create a bit of a challenge. And there's really not a lot that protects the flame other than the lid and your hand. So you do have to be mindful of that. But if you're looking for a soft flame and you're looking for something that's different and certainly has some unique features to it uh, in terms of the triple flame, 
the Meridian is definitely something that is worth considering. It does come at a pretty steep premium because really when you look at uh, other comparable soft flame lighters, you know, you can find a lot in the $20 range and then up into the $50, $60, $70 range. And then, like I say, this jumps up to $149.99. And then you really do go up to like the ST DuPonts, which are $800 and up from there. So there is something to be considered about with the price. And again, the size is, you know, a little bit bigger than normal. So you want to take that into consideration. But in terms of day-to-day -day usage, I found this to be incredibly reliable, great lighting capability, and generally a very solid lighter, very solidly made, nice metal body, feels good in the hand, good heft, good weight, and uh, a lighter that I did really do enjoy using. So that's the Zycar Meridian. Read more about it here on Half Wheel. And thanks for checking out halfwheel.com, your source for the latest in cigar industry news, reviews, and much, much more.